Right, mighty Thetford fridge in your Boosner to scroll through the functions. First of all, ensure your 12 volt is on, which you can see by the green indicator light on the on off switch. If you've accidentally turned it off, the fridge will power off and you'll have no function. So make sure your 12 volt is switched on the board, and you can see you're on now. The screen will go into sleep mode after about 10 seconds, so don't be fooled by that. So you can always request it back on by pushing the grey button. As you can see now, it's gone to sleep. So push the grey button in the middle. It will tell you what you've selected as a power source. So at the moment I'm on automatic. I'm using sure power, 230 volts, and I'm on full cooling strength. If I'm to change this option, I simply select it, so on. Now I push and hold the grey center button. It will now flash. And using the cursor, I can scroll through my source all the way through back to automatic. Sure power, 230 volts. Battery driving, which is a maintained function, or gas. I'll go for gas first, so I'll select that once again on the middle button. It'll now ask me to select my operating range, whether strong cooling or low cooling. Depending on the weather, a good area is actually to start as in the mid range, so that way the fridge isn't working too hard. And then after you get a good cooling, you can increase it. Okay? And then obviously confirm it once again the middle button and it will give you feedback and say you have selected gas full cooling however if you want to change that once again you just push and hold the grey button you can see how the gas flashes and you can use either cursor but I always use the right one to scroll through your desired function if you are plugged into shore power or 230 mains and you select it and you select your heat range and the vehicle is running it will not shift to battery the fridge will always look for a primary 231st as you can see and you can probably hear the vehicle running so don't be concerned it won't flick over but for purpose of demonstration I will throw the main switch and you will see it toggle over okay I've just throwing the mains okay it's going oh no no 230 so I select it go back to auto Confirm. it's on battery on auto and when I turn the mains back on it will automatically shift back to short power just like that okay now if you have selected automatic and you're driving which will look like this on automatic so you're driving automatic on battery maintain and you pull into a service station or a shop and you may have accidentally left the gas on there is a 12 minute stand down before this unit will move over to gas. So don't be perturbed, it's not instantaneous. But only from battery to gas. Otherwise that's how you function it. So push and hold when it's illuminated. You can choose your source, automatic or manual section only, which is 230 mains, shore power. Battery driving, which is a maintain function. And of course gas. And then your desired calling range low to medium to high. Confirm, feedback, sweet airs. Cool.